it's kind of like the blood coursing through my veins, you know? It brings everything together in my life for me. It's a place where I work. It's a place where I sleep. It's a place where I draw inspiration. It's a place where I fell in love. It's a place where I'll raise my family. It's like this magnet that brings all these important elements of my life together. So it's like the heartbeat. I met Teresa because of the ocean. We sailed together on two separate boats, and now we're looking for one boat together. Living on a boat is a great way to be out in nature, in the world as part of the world. So we had to become separated from the world, the ocean, the environment. Living in a house, living in a car, living at your job, living on a boat was like being exposed all the time. I see the ocean as a great source of inspiration. I'm a writer and I do some of my best work when I'm near the ocean. You know, whatever, wherever people go for inspiration or, for, or to be awed, I think the ocean is like the only place. And it's constantly changing, there's always something new and mysterious and exciting, whether it be the weather or the tides or the color. It's not always blue. The ocean is a wonderful place to develop a relationship. I see the ocean as the ultimate source of romance <laughs> on this planet. We spent several years living on two separate boats but traveling together on the ocean before we finally decided to get married just a month ago. I think it's pulled us together and made us such a great team. I see the ocean as a place to work, to make a living, whether it's fishing or clamming. It's such an amazing tool for education, so uh, I think that's why I continue to turn to the ocean as a topic to teach and a place to teach at. I see the ocean as the only place to raise my children. I don't know, my philosophy is that I'd rather work in conjunction with my environment rather than change it, and the ocean is the perfect place to teach that lesson. I see it more as like this opportunity to go out there and, and face challenges and be humbled and also at the same time realize your greatest strengths. And um, it's kind of a give and take. You've got to work with the ocean because you really can't work against it. <laughs>